Hello, you lovely lot, and welcome to Expert Zone and our how to series, where we're going to show you how to do things with Microsoft products, this time with an actual Windows device. <laughs> Many people believe that the likes of the Office apps are included as part of the purchase with Windows devices. Unfortunately, this isn't accurate and a subscription to Microsoft 365 or an Office 2021 license is required to have access to the likes of Word, Excel and PowerPoint in their full functionality. So how do you get Microsoft 365 on a Windows device? Now there are multiple different ways of activating Microsoft 365 on a Windows device. So what we've done with this video is we've split it up into multiple different sections. So you can just go to the section that you want, get the information you need, rather than having to watch the whole thing, which will take quite a lot longer. So section one is gonna be around an active Microsoft 365 account. If you have one all ready to go and just wanna know how to get logged in, then uh, jump to section one. Section two is gonna be around pre-purchase. Maybe you have a card or a digital download code and you're not quite sure what to do with it. So head to section two and I'll show you how you can activate your 365 if you have one of those. Section three is gonna be around if you don't have Microsoft 365 at all. So how you can get started with Microsoft 365 and I'll take you through how you can set up your own subscription. All of the information is in the description below so you can just jump to the timestamp that you want and I'll uh, see you there. I'll uh, see you there. Nope, nope, still here. How's your day going? Good, yeah. Section one, active Microsoft 365. If you already have an active Microsoft 365 subscription, then simply open up one of the Office applications like Word and sign in to the Microsoft account with the attributed subscription. Most of the time, Windows will link to the profile you're already logged into, making life even easier and get you off and running even faster. Section 2. Pre-Purchased If you have a pre-purchased card or a digital download code, then you will need to open up your choice of internet browser and head to setup.office.com, the link of which is in the description below. Once there, hit sign in, and if like me, you're signed into and using Edge, it will just log you into the connected Microsoft account. If not, sign in to the Microsoft account you want the Microsoft 365 license attributed to. Next, enter the product key. This will be the 25 digit code under the silver strip on the back of your card, or you will have received as part of your digital download purchase. Select the region you are living in and hit next. Tick this little box if you want more information, tips or offers about Microsoft 365 and hit confirm. You have now activated your Microsoft 365 license and from here you can find out more information about sharing your subscription if like us you've gone with Microsoft 365 family. If you don't have the Office applications installed on your device then hit this button here and then the install Office button. Choose the default version of Office unless you have a specific need and this will download the Office Setup application. Once it's downloaded, open the application and let it kind of do what it needs to do and download all of the Microsoft 365 apps to your device. If you already have the Office apps pre-installed on your device, as most devices will, then open up any of the Office apps. Provided the Microsoft account with the 365 license attached, is the same as the profile logged in on the Windows device, it will automatically log you in and let you use your Microsoft 365 subscription to its fullest. Section 3. Getting started with Microsoft 365 
If you don't have a Microsoft 365 subscription already, do not fret. Head to the Microsoft Store and search for Microsoft 365. From here, you have two options of Microsoft 365. Microsoft 365 Personal is a one user license that will give you access to the premium Office apps, a terabyte of online cloud storage with Microsoft OneDrive, and can be used on up to five devices at the same time. You can even choose whether you want monthly billing at $5.99 a month, or if you want to go with yearly billing at $59.99 a year. If you think there is just one other person in your life that could benefit from having a Microsoft 365 subscription, then we would go with Microsoft 365 Family, which gives you the same great features and benefits of personal, including the premium Office apps, terabyte of online cloud storage with Microsoft OneDrive, and can be used across multiple devices at the same time, though this time it's up to six people each person getting their own terabyte of online cloud storage and being able to use the license on up to five devices of their own as well. And all for just $7.99 a month or yearly billing at $79.99 a year. Choose the license and subscription method that suits you the best and then hit the big blue button. Confirm it's you. We're lucky to have a Windows Hello device to show this on. If you're not, just use the password to log in and hit next. And this is the part where we can't really help you as it's uh, your bank details that are needed. So input those and hit save and follow the rest of the instructions to activate your Microsoft 365 license. If you don't have the premium Office apps pre-installed, then select the install button when available for Windows to download all of the programs that you need to your device. If you have the Office apps pre-installed, which in the majority of the time will be the case, you can just go back to a Word, Excel or PowerPoint application and jump straight into the Microsoft app once you're signed in. Sorted. And there you have it. You should now have your Microsoft 365 license active and ready to go, giving you the likes of the premium Office apps to create and organize your life how you want to, a terabyte of online cloud storage in Microsoft OneDrive to keep all the things that are precious to you safe and sound and can be used on up to five different devices per person. Sorted. Now, if you found this video helpful at all, please drop a like down below and let us know in the comments which section you found most helpful. If you want more from us here at Expert Zone UK and I, be that our how-to videos, unboxing videos, or overview videos, then please subscribe for more. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll uh, see you later on.